What's up everybody? Tiffany Outdoors here and today... Hi, it's Joe. It's Joe. Y'all, so we don't know how this is going to turn out, but Joe bought some dragon fruit. I've never had dragon fruit. I only know what it looks like. It's white with black things in it. Right, like little seeds. I'm hoping not. <laughs> seeds. Boy, I know. That may... It might be some trouble for us, but we're going to try this dragon fruit for the very first time. So let's get into this. Let's see. There's the hawk. Before there was a Tiffany outdoors, there was Tiffany the farmer. Are you turn when possible? No, we're not. peeling off and I know that the peel is uh, you don't eat that okay you no know, like an apple you would eat the peel yeah, some people this do. you don't now this this is kind of soft so where is dragon fruit from do you know if you do comment down below <laughs> Comment down below if you know. Alright y'all, so let's get a close look at this. Look at that. It's very pretty. I usually see it cut up in squares. Oh yeah. When people like oh. have it. Is it from I'm guessing that dragon fruit is from Japan because just because it's called dragon. Yeah, well, it is grown in Asia and Mexico, Central oh. America, South America, and Israel. Oh, interesting. I didn't know it was grown in that many different countries. I'm butchering this up so bad. So, I've heard of people saying that it doesn't really have much of a taste. That it's kind of bland. What have you heard about I haven't heard mm -hmm. any anything about the dragon fruit on oh, what it really? tastes like. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's, you know, it's, even though I love watching Food Network shows and such, I either just haven't paid attention to whatever the taste is supposed to be or, or what, just have heard people say they like it. I, I'm almost <laughs> imagining it kind of tasting like kiwi very light taste yeah with a tartness to it that's that's what I'm imagining just because it feels it feels like kiwi in my hands okay so I'm kind of um, interesting I want to get all the peel off because they say the peel is like no good to eat okay like it'll make you sick if you eat it okay well there are, there are like a million seeds. Um, that, that's there are. That's probably Thank what's you. going to make me sick, if anything. Oh, gosh. All <laughs> right, y'all. Let me move this camera back up into our faces. And if you guys are wondering why I keep saying anything about seeds and not eating them, um, it's because I, I have Crohn's, Tiffany has IBS, and seeds are one of those things that are just not good for the digestive system. Yeah, they kind of irritate us and get into the, like, the nooks and crannies and things. And nooks and crannies that our diseases like to create in our intestines. <laughs> Me, holes for sure. Alright, cheers. Cheers. You're about to eat it without me. Okay, here we go. Yeah. Is it supposed to taste like this? What's this supposed to taste like? Oh yeah, it's not good. It's really plain. It really is. It's not even sweet. No, it's not. It has is it no too taste. Right? Zero taste at all. It tastes kind of. It does have the consistency of kiwi. Yeah. But it has the like the little seeds, the little light crunch like kiwi. Really, no, the seeds are not bad at all. But there's like literally no taste. 
I was expecting tartness, some sweet. It's not that great. Your taste buds <laughs> will enjoy it. <laughs> Lies. <laughs> eating it right there's a how is it eat. is it too ripe i don't know there's a how it seems eat. like the riper it gets the sweeter it'll get but there's like no taste no flavor and now like i said uh, there's there's a guy that i watch on tiktok from time to time all he eats is fruit i mean he'll have a gigantic plate of fruit and he's like i'm just gonna eat this fruit and talk to you guys and somebody asked him what the dragon fruit tasted like he said there's no taste to it it's just yeah so it says that it may look exotic, but the flavors are similar to other fruits. Like um, it's got a sweet, uh, sweet, slightly sweet cross between a kiwi and a pear. Okay, so kiwi. I was kind of right on yeah. the kiwi part. I mean, it is a very, very light, very light taste. It's not sweet. It's, I wouldn't. I wouldn't I'm not enjoying it. I would say that the sweetness that it has is so light, you barely notice it. Yeah, so that would be something that you would probably enjoy. I like sweet, like sugar. I don't want it to be sweet, sweet, like an apple, like a honey crisp apple. I think this would be good along with other fruits, along with actually fruits that have more of a, like a twang or something. I bet this would be good with kiwi. It probably would be good with kiwi and with pear together. I oh think. yeah, probably with some pears. I mean, I don't know. I'm I'm not disliking it. I like it. I don't like it. It's not sweet enough, and it have, doesn't have enough flavor to. But you also like things like to me, watermelon. The fruit is very flavorless to me. Why? But you I, like watermelon. I think it's so sweet. I don't think it's sweet at all, and <laughs> I just don't. I ate it when I was a kid, but now as an adult, I don't want it. Hmm. I, don't, mm -mm. I just think the watermelon is so, it's one of those fruits that are just so sweet, sweeter than most any fruit that I eat. <laughs> I had no words. I was going to say something smart, but I couldn't come up with anything. <laughs> To me, sweet is a honey crisp apple. Now that is my favorite fruit, is a honey crisp apple. Have y'all tried honey crisp apple? Oh my goodness, the flavor is just so sweet, intense, bright. Apples are one of those things that I'm not really allowed to have. Yeah, because of the peel. But I peel not my honey just, crisp. It's not just the peel, the entire apple is very fibrous. It is very fibrous. Yeah, I like uh, this. You can have it. I probably shouldn't be eating it. Before. I was about to say, don't eat it because of the seeds. Oh, yeah. Eating too true. much of it. That's right. Let me stop where I'm Those at. Those little tiny seeds are going to get you. Do you have to work tomorrow? <laughs> yeah. Those tiny yeah. seeds are going to get you. They will. But this was interesting. This was fun. Yes. Yes. It just isn't my cup of tea. I've got to just, you know, look at some of the things that you can do with this fruit like pair it with with yeah, kiwi something. and pears something you know as it's much got as the same probably the same mouthfeel maybe honestly where my mind is going right now is away from fruit completely into something that i'm not crazy about i love red wine red wine is so dry so good, so bitter. I like I a sweet red. This, this I think would taste good with some white wine. White wine? Yeah. Oh. I really think that if, it, if we had a glass of white wine with a bite of this, I think it would just really... Bring out the flavor, you think? I, I think it would. I mean, I'm not Or I'm not add a flavor. I think it would add, I think the wine would add flavor to the fruit. Yes, yes, I think so too. <clears throat> I'm not a hater of white wine. I just prefer red. <laughs> Y'all, sometimes I have to save her from herself. Y'all don't understand. <laughs> These seeds will have her. Oh, God. 
wrecked. <laughs> totally wrecked. You know that, right? I know that. <laughs> I do. I know it. I care about you so much. I know you want to eat that. And I really want to let you eat that. But I don't like it when you're sick and you haven't been sick in a long time. You've it's been like being at the store looking at a can of cashews. I know. <laughs> the nuts. Oh. It's going, you know you want them. Just buy them. But you know I, it'll hurt. Yeah, it'll hurt. It'll hurt so bad. She will pay for days and days and days. <laughs> I'm not controlling her food intake. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> Just things that will hurt her, right? That's true. It will. Um, yeah, it really will. Yeah, because I don't, I don't, you know. I know. I, I do. feel I bad don't. for you when you're not doing well. And I want you to be doing well. You've been doing well for a long time, so. River gets it for me. <laughs> I really don't feel bad right now. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sick. I'm not sick. Eat it, and then next day, ooh. Our dog, River, will eat anything that you're eating except celery. Except but, uh, celery. <laughs> We say that a lot because she really... She, she'll take it. It's so funny. She'll take it. She's so polite about it. <laughs> she, Thank you, lady. And then she'll go and <laughs> spit it out. And then look at you like, <laughs> I have something else? That was delicious. <laughs> now let's give me more, just not that. <laughs> and some of the things that she eats <laughs> cause her stomach issues, like <laughs> junk food, snack food. Chips are no good for her. They really are not. Yeah, and, and you know we don't feed her a lot of people food, no. but she loves to eat it. Cause I know we've said this in other videos. She's allergic to all yes. proteins except for fish. Even I gave her some shrimp because I thought it would be okay. <laughs> oh no. my god! I gave her two shrimp and I cut them up. Oh my gosh, she was just mm -mm. miserable for like two days. Yeah, her stomach just went crazy. I thought for sure the shrimp would be okay, but nope. No, I guess not all seafood is mm -hmm. good for her either. Yeah, so fish stuff is good for her, and fruits and vegetables are good. Yeah. And luckily, she does like fruit and vegetables. Yes. She loves peas and green beans and carrots. Sweet potatoes. The sweet potatoes. We, we do give her that stuff. We shred it up for her now. Shut it up for her, and uh, she loves it like that. Yeah. But yeah, we we all three of us have stomach issues. It's just <laughs> it's so weird. It's like everyone takes <sighs> turns. Yeah. Although lately she's been taking her turn a lot. She has been taking her turn. So <clears throat> poor girl. But anyway, this was fun. This was fun. This, this was, was fun. fun. All right, y'all, click that like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. We'll see you all in the next video. Bye. Bye. about the poor little girl. Yeah, that didn't really have much flavor. I don't want you to get sick, honey. You're right. You're absolutely right. Oh.